And welcome to the super fun, awesome, happy time. Oh my God, there's some sounds in space. Pedal show, my name is Gabor. Wow. Hey, welcome along. I'm Alex. I'm going to check out the Meteor Distortion today. Yes. Uh, fun little distortion box. Please hit like and subscribe on the channel first. Give it a thumb, thumbs up and ding the notification bell. Yep. Comments or questions below. Please do. And uh, should mention this was provided by the good folks at Space Sounds right here in Australia. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so it's couple. a Meteor Distortion. Mm -hmm. It's a very simple but quite an effective pedal simply yet effective uh it's got the re-entry knob which is just volume and it's got the altitude um diode switch or clipping switch yep. uh, where you go from boost to overdrive to distortion that's it uh to hear the pedal we're going through a Mosatronics amp switcher into a cherry tone ots mini 20 head and a two note torpedo capital x for the cabinet sims yes yes and then to your ear holes uh, all right, should we check it out? Uh, we're going to start off with a clean amp, but then we're going to go into a dirty amp as well just to try different things. We're going to start things. off with a T-Style, also strain made, Tompkins. Yeah. And uh, clean. Uh, any reverb you hear is from the Captor X. So, so let's start with the altitude up. Which is boosters in the middle. Oh, it's boosters in the middle, okay. Yeah. And then overdrives up and distortion is down. Aha. Uh -huh. Settings. That guy, he knows that kind so, of stuff. So should we start? Okay, middle. Just boost. Boost. Let's go boosty. We're boosting the front of the amp. Boost it. Boost it a lot. Should we actually try it just quickly? Yo. So it was a dirty channel of the amp. Um, yeah, there's a lot of boost there. Yeah. I mean, but that's a boost. Does okay, things. so let's go overdrive. And I mean, the, the, the re-entry knob, it's not more giving you more gain. It's oh. just hitting more volume as well, which then in turn hits the front end of the amp more, which then in turn breaks everything up more. More, um, more is more. More is more. So now let's let's just do the same thing. And this is now the distortion clipping mode. <laughs> Straightforward, but it sounds great. It sounds really good. You know, we go on a uh, we, different guitar. Okay, let's do it with P90s now with uh, oh. Yamaha Revstar RSS 02T in Sunset Burst, wow, which cool. unmeteorically distorted. <laughs> so, let's see. Okay. What do you want to start off with? Uh, some boost. Boost. <laughs> Thank you. 
It sounds good. I mean, it's no frills. Yeah, but it's, it's all there, isn't it? It does what it does well. Okay, should we do humbuckers? Humbuckers. Rocks, yeah, for some reason, like, yeah, yeah, definitely, yeah. definitely has that kind of vibe to it, like yeah. Led Zeppelin y kind of sound, or yeah, not, not copywriting, yes, no, 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 no. <laughs> well, again, let's try just to, yeah, push it. Maybe I'll turn the Pushing a dirty amp really well too. It's very kind of punchy and forward. Yeah, okay. well, it's a good lead boost because yeah. it is a so punching forward. Now, should we try it? I know what everyone wants to know. <laughs> oh, do they? What does it sound like do with, really... uh, yes, with an offset style guitar with an aluminium neck made by Bagley guitars, a body made by Vander guitars, uh, uh, a vibrato by Descendant Vibrato, a mastery bridge, and Herod aluminium uh, custom pickguard. Uh, Curtis Novak pickups and string switch noise wiring. Wow. Isn't that what everyone wants to know? Apparently. And it's tuned to uh, C, to uh, C standard tuning. So if I play an E chord, it's actually a C chord. Yeah. And that E chord, if I play it uh, on this guitar with this tuning, it's actually a C chord. Huh. <laughs> Help from uh, line six delay. Playing a bit louder than speaking volume. Yeah. And that was feeding back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it was big. It was massive. That was... That was sounded great, actually. Now, hang on. What if we do that? Same thing now, but into the distorted channel. So this is now just the distorted channel. No feedback. Let's do the delay as well. Was that the clean channel? It was on a clean channel before. Oh, wow.
Mark. That's cool though. That makes it it really embiggens. Goes from boost to doom. Yeah. Yeah, cool. What do you guys think? Comment yeah. below. Um, yeah. uh, big thank you to Space Sounds as well. Check out Pretty our great. demo of the Galactic Fuzz uh, up here. And there's a tremolo coming up as well soon, a video with that. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I, li I like them. It's sort of very 50s. We talked about it in a podcast the other day, actually. It's very... Um, turn that off. It's very sort of futuristic uh, 50s looks. Yep. You know, like... In the year 2000. In the future. In the future, yes. Yeah. Doc Brown with the Ro silver outfit. Yeah, robot wives and stuff. Yes, robot <laughs> Yeah, um, but yeah, I like the look. I like they're, they're they're cool pedals. Check them out. They're not super pricey either. Links to everything below. Big thank you to the awesome people at Space Sounds for sending this out as well. And thanks, see, thanks. Yeah. Yeah. see you. Yeah, see you next one. See you soon.